So today, I had to drop off some packages to the post office. Uh, so I figured on the way back I can stop at Chipotle and uh, grab something to eat so that way I don't have to cook anything when I get home. Use the app, the Chipotle app, which usually works okay, fair enough. Um, so, ordered the food. It's supposed to be there at 2.15. It's supposed to be ready at 2.15. Uh, I get there like at 2.10. I wait uh, in the parking lot till like 2.15. Walk slowly. In. That's the only way I can walk now because of my, my ankle. And nothing there. Yeah, this you ever ordered from them before you know they you, the idea is you order on the app and you just walk in and pick your shit up and leave you know it's on it's on a shelf with your name on it waiting for you on the honor system so nothing there and there's a sign that says if you order online or on the app see the cashier which is a thing I was trying not to fucking do so I go see the cashier and the cashier is busy as hell so people coming in because they work at a Chipotle, which is in a mall, which is next to a, a theater, which is open. I just can't get over the fact that there's the theaters open, but I guess they have to make money too. And there's people who are desperate enough to go see a movie and they'll, you know, they'll risk their lives and whatever. But anyway, she said, okay, well, she gives a standard corporate answer of, we have it, but it's not ready. We're running behind. And there are people like on the signs on the table. The sign is saying that you know this this is closed. This section's closed. But the people just sitting on the, sitting at the tables. There's families like eating unmasked because you can't eat without a, you know with a mask on. And then there's like this is what I did not want to do. I did not want to stand in here with people with fucking masks off. You know. So two three minutes pass. I'm just like I'm getting the fuck out of here. I'm just gonna go stand outside until it's ready. And it's like people are coming in behind me, or people are coming in from the theater, from the mall, or in more shit. And the staff is freaking out. So it's like, fuck, I'm at Chipotle. You know, I'm, I'm the only foods I can eat. Um, you know, they're like so called fast foods. And uh, I'm like, this, this is just so fucked up. But, uh, and I felt bad for the, the people behind the counter because I know that. I've been in that position before. I know it's uh, it's tough being between the product and and uh, the customer on one side and the corporate on the other side. You know, it's just but still, you know, it's just, just fuck, you know, this is this is just not not right, man. You know, it's a Saturday, sure, but you know, I should have known better to even just do it on a Saturday. I should have. I usually just go during the week when it's the slow times and I'll pick up something on the way home. But you know, it's like 2.30, you know, she finally walks it out there and she's, you know, I'm standing by the door and she's like, okay, great, you know, I, I got it. And she's, you know, I think she apologizes or whatever, but it doesn't even matter. You know, it's just so, I mean, man, this is just, so, so long story short, it is too late. I ended up just wasting more time than I would have saved. I still had to stop and get gas. And if they had put me behind, I could have gotten the gas first and then gone to pick up the shit if I know it's going to be that late. You know, but, yeah. And then they just put my whole day behind uh, in, a, in a cold Chipotle anyway. So what the hell is the point? <laughs> so I'm two days behind now on my, on my Inktober. I got videos to put up. I'm, I'm editing videos. Trying to get those done. I'm gonna finish them tonight. It's just I got a dog that's marking the fucking house. You know, it's just it's, it's just, just shit going on. You know, it's just, you know, it could be first world problems, but you know, fuck it. You know, it's problems nonetheless. So that's it for today.